So here is another video of MPC Club and what we will be showing you today is how you configure the QNAP NAS server with the upcoming V3.3 firmware for the Q Mobile application you can use on your iPhone. Now this is a cool application in my opinion that could use a little more tweaking but we'll get back to that later on. So the first thing we need to do is just log on to our administrative console which we're quickly gonna do now and once you're in there you browse down to your network services now a new feature integrated into the network services discovery is underneath the bonjour tab Q Mobile for iPhone and iPod touch this needs to be enabled in the first place and while you can configure the Q Mobile application manually this actually supports a detection wizard so once this is enabled we just go to the web server under network services and enable it now this is necessary for QNAP mobile to connect to the NAS later on once this is enabled you just browse down to the applications underneath the network services here and then go to the multimedia station and enable it now you can see there's a show service link on the login page option which only toggles the icon on the main logon screen we're just gonna leave it there because it's quite handy uh, we just apply the multimedia station now and once this is done you get two links and you can test it out to see if you actually see the content uh, using multimedia station now the content you see here is files and folders you place underneath the Q multimedia share there's no other uh, possibility to share the data so now we're just gonna log out and still show you the icon that's on the main page this here multimedia station clicking on it will just bring you to your data now there's one more very important thing I need to tell you the NAS is ready for iPhone, isn't this so cool? I just told you how to do it so you don't feel like a fool.